guys, welcome back. Today I'm gonna to be sharing with you some tips to make your guests feel comfortable in your home. I wanted to make this room feel almost like you're staying at a hotel, you know, like really cozy. First thing is definitely having a comfortable place uh, for your guests to sleep or yourself. And that's why I think the mattress is very important. So the mattress that I decided to go with for a bedroom is by a brand named Casper. And they're the only company that I know of that actually delivers the bed to your door in a box. My sister had actually bought the same exact bed. She got the queen size a few months back and my mom unboxed it all by herself. So I wanted to see how easy it was by doing it on my own. I even called my mom and I was like, okay, so how do you unbox this thing? The instructions were really simple. It came with three pamphlets. I was gonna have my husband do it for me, but then I thought not everybody's gonna have somebody around to help them when they're getting this mattress in. So I wanna see if I can do it by myself. And sure enough, I was able to unbox the entire thing on my own. It comes in a total of six sizes and you have a 10 year full warranty and they also allow you to try it for a hundred nights and if for whatever reason you're not satisfied you can call them up and they'll send somebody to pick it up and get it recycled for you or donate it it's also made out of certified memory and latex foam so it keeps you cool at night which i think is really helpful especially if you tend to um, be somebody that gets really warm at night i think your guests would really appreciate that the shipping is two to five days and you can get same day shipping if you live in New York City. So that's a plus. Casper is sponsoring this video. So they're offering all my subscribers a $50 off discount. If you use this code that is flashing across the screen right now. And I will also leave more information down in the info box and a link to the actual website so you can check it out. Now that I told you guys a little bit about the sponsor of this video, I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the tips on how to make your guests comfortable when they are staying with you. I also recommend getting some nice fluffy pillows, something that you would want to sleep on, and then maybe an extra blanket. And this is a faux fur blanket from Z Gallery. It's really, really cozy, especially if you're having guests over during the holiday season, which tend to be the winter months. Another really nice touch, I think, for your guests is to have either a basket or a tray set up with snacks and beverages. I know whenever I stay the night at somebody's house, once they go to bed, I feel uncomfortable going into the kitchen. Set out something like sweet, something salty, something healthier like a granola bar, definitely some water bottles, and also maybe a different type of beverage. If you know what your guests like, then you can cater these snacks towards their taste. Aside from having some snacks and beverages for your guests to enjoy, I'd also recommend having another uh, separate basket. And I just filled it with things that uh, my guests may have forgotten, like a toothbrush, a mouthwash, toothpaste. I also added a loofah, some body lotion, Advil, or just any pain reliever. Maybe they get a headache in the middle of the night and they don't want to wake you up. It's really nice to just have any kind of painkiller in that little basket. I would put the tissues in the same area that you have your toiletries. Also, don't forget to have a trash can somewhere near. In the same section that you have the toiletries, I would recommend putting a basket filled with clean towels and also an extra blanket in case your guests get cold. You could also do something else like um, a robe or slippers. Next to the bed, I would recommend putting a lamp or a reading lamp. Nowadays, everybody has some sort of phone, tablet, something like that. So I highly recommend having a charging station. Fresh flowers just tend to lift your spirits, brighten your day, and they just put you in a really good mood. I'd also recommend putting out a bowl, like a catch-it-all bowl, something that your guests could put things like their wallet, their keys. And then I just added this cute little horse thing figurine. I just thought it added a nice touch. and I just got this basket that I also found at Home Goods, and I filled it up with different books. Of course, if you know who's coming over and you know what kind of content they like to read, you can put those type of books in there, but I just kind of put a bunch of different ones in here that I'm just gonna permanently keep in this room. Just like fun books that have fun pictures or interesting things, and I set those right next to the bed because I feel like if you're already in bed, you're more likely to just like roll over and reach for it and it just makes it really convenient. So on the other side of the bed, I added a notebook with a pen in case your guests want to like write or they have to take down notes and they need pen and paper. And then right next to that, I put a little jewelry box. I would recommend leaving it open so your guests feel comfortable 
comfortable about using it. I feel like if it's closed, they may not feel comfortable opening it. I think it's also a good idea to have somewhere where they can set their suitcase on top so that they can open it and take things out of it instead of having to put it all on the floor and having to bend down to the floor to grab things. So that is it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed these tips. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos. I put out videos on Sundays and during the weekday. And I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.